Glad you like yours wearing that. Okay, so we have just talked, copied down these notes, and what we want to do is look at binary fission and budding, and then, then what we're going to do is we're going to go further into this PowerPoint and list some other examples. So the, what we want you to understand is we expect you to look at one of these names and be able to match an organism that does it. And But we're going to go into more detail about number two and three. So that's what we're going to do now. Binary fission. Earlier, you copied this down. So let's put this in sequence and let's practice it, how we get this by... So we're going to number, but I want you to look at this scenario. Think about this. This is not eukaryotic cell cycle. This is bacteria. They're prokaryotic. So this is these five scenarios are their cell cycle and their form, their form of mitosis. So I have a very poorly drawn picture that will help you see this. Okay? So first, imagine that being a bacteria. Right smack dab in the center. What is that? Huh? It's, it's genetic material. It's its nuclear area. It doesn't have a nuclear membrane. So the first thing that's going to happen is, ooh, I made a copy. Now I made a green so you can see. All right. So what's, what's the first one? What do we label? B. So number one is B. The two chromosomes uh, copies. No, that can't be B. You said C. Good. All right. Let's uh, erase that. It's good that I caught my error, or you caught my error. So let's erase that. Go back to the pen. Okay. So the bacteria copies its DNA. So we just saw that. All right. So it copied its DNA. Now what happens? Hey, look, they don't have a central centriole. They don't have spindle fibers. They don't have the organelles the membrane-bound organelles that eukaryotic cells do. So that's why their mitosis or their, is a little different. So look what I've just done. Where, what's happening? What's happening here? What did I do to the genetic material? I did what? I went to the top. I attached it to the plasma membrane. So what's our next one? A. So step two is the two copies of the chromosome attached to the plasma membrane. So now, as the cytoplasm expands in volume, it's going to push it away. So here we are. So let's kind of watch what's going on. It's expanding. It's, it's expanding. All right. If mitosis or asexual reproduction is one cell dividing into two, remember one cell dividing into two. All right. Making exact copies, all right, that's what we're trying to figure out. So let's go and put this back up here. Go back to our other list. So what's next? Yes? Three. B. B is step three. So as you just saw us, the copies separate as the cell grows, all right? Now what do we got to do? We've got to get ready to do something. If we're going to have two cells... We just separated the DNA. That's like the bacteria version of anaphase. Now we need the bacteria version of what? Telophase. And cytokinesis. So what's next? Look at it. That's backwards. I shouldn't. All right. All right, so. Okay, what's next? You're saying E? And you're correct, so let's go ahead and finish this. So now we have five steps, five steps to binary fission, and the key thing that you should underline is genetically identical to the parent cells. Genetically identical to the parent cells. So let's so I'll put that back up there in a second. There we go, we have a barrier. Now we have two cells. That's a form of asexual reproduction. Does everyone have that? Now what I want to do is close off this video, but I want to quickly show you budding. Budding. And it's very simplistic. First, take a look. Standard division, budding. Okay. If it's asexual reproduction, are these two daughter cells and these two daughter cells genetically identical to their parent cell? 
No. Budding is a type of asexual reproduction. So let's ask the question again. Are these daughter cells identical genetically, I mean the DNA, to the parent cells? Yes. Standard is, look, they're half the size. These are half the size, so they have half the cytoplasm, but they have the same DNA. I haven't drawn it in there. So if you were to say, describe standard, like any asexual reproduction, to budding, what's the difference? Yes? Size. Size. Okay? So see if this makes sense. Unequal cytokinesis. Unequal cytokinesis. So here's the fact I want you to write about budding. Both daughter cells are genetically identical, but there's different volumes of cytoplasm. Right? So that's budding. And I'm going to go ahead and put this, I'm going to go ahead and just stop the video so you guys can uh, copy this down. Glad you like yours, Ram, man.